Hello everybody. I hope you're having a great day. I want to hop on really quick and share with you this delightfully sweet book that I recently made. You can get a look at the cover. It's got the scalloped edges and kind of a shabby chic look. This is a perfect size if you're for learning how to sew a book. It's easy to hold in your hand so you can get the stitching in. Um, it, it's just it's just a nice size. It's just a nice size to start with. So let me start opening it up and you can take a look. I've got this sweet little page here, a little tuck on the inside. Card with the vintage button on it. I just love those. Buttons just add such character. On this side here, I have a little flip pocket. I've got my doily there and I have a tuck spot here that I glued on that has some little pieces there to write some secret notes on. Some, some little, little words. Over here I have a little flip page, opens up and you can see it has some beautiful paper on each side and then this comes out for that tuck spot. Pretty cool, huh? They can go like that. Sweet, huh? Nice little edge of lace. I made a card right there. You can put something over the back to write and tuck in. Little tabs here. Here's where the binding is, and there's little rosettes that have been placed. I decided to put four instead of two. I thought it was just kind of fun. So an edge here, an edge here. Now if you like this book, this is the exact same pattern of a different book that I'm going to be doing and showing you how to make. I just use the same pattern and use this other paper to make it. Pocket. These are some pages right here that you can write on. I've got another button. I've got my button action on. This right here I made, it flips up, so it's a little bit different. Let's see what we have on the next page. We have this sweet little pocket right here. It's a little corner tuck pocket, and then I have these. Just that little bit of stuff on the top just makes such a nice little difference. So some writing pages, once again, to write your secret little notes on. This latch page here, I just I just like. It's just sweet with the scalloped edge on the inside as well as seeing on the trim from the book cover. So when you open it up, I have a little side pocket here that this tucks into. This comes out, you can write on both sides, and then it's got this back page that you can also use. So, I hope you liked my sweet little book. Let's take a look at the very back of the cover. I just like that. You could put something like that and write your name in it actually so then you can sign the books that you made. That's what I was kind of having in mind when I saw that piece of paper. So if you like this book, uh, be watching for my little tutorial that's coming up. It uses the exact same pattern as the one that I'll be teaching. And then you can make this one yourself. Get Grab some paper from Hobby Lobby. So have a great day and I will talk to you later. Bye.